Here we're at techsmith.com slash Camtasia, and you can just type in Camtasia.com. It'll take you to the same screen. And this is a video editing software that you can download for free for 30 days. And this is what I use to actually create these courses and these lectures. And once you're on the homepage, all you have to do is click on free trial. What I'm going to show you in this video is how to create a watermark. I'm actually going to show you two methods. One is with this video editing software that I use, a really simple way to do that. And then one is if you already have your videos on YouTube, you can actually add a watermark directly from your YouTube dashboard. So if we click on free trial here, all you're going to have to do is give them your email address and create a password. So you'd enter that there click there and then click sign up and they're gonna send you the download instructions in your email and just to save us some time since I know you know how to download stuff um, this is the icon you're gonna get once it's downloaded and installed on your computer and then this would be your dashboard here and this is actually the old version of this lecture that I'm doing now I'm, I'm updating it as we speak so in your main dashboard here you have a couple options up at the top this is to record the screen so if you click on that you would see a little thing like that and this is actually me recording right now and you would have a little red button there that you would click and that would start recording whatever you're doing on the screen and you can use this program if you want to edit some videos in the future too it's not just for watermarks and then this is the import media button at the top here so you can import an mp4 mp3 uh, wmv any type of file that you've created sound or video and then it would show up there in the little box on the left like you see the little icons there and then finally when you're done editing it and recording you would just click this produce and share button and I like to go to custom production settings so you can change some things up I like to go with the mp4 here since that's the most common type of video file that'll be checked automatically you click next and then uncheck that produce with controller since we're doing this for YouTube and they already have a controller and then I like to move that all the way to the right so it's the highest quality video. That'll be like a 1080p, like HD quality. And then here's the watermark I was talking about. So you put a check mark in there and then click the options. You pick your folder and find the image. You want to use a PNG file uh, because PNG files typically have transparent backgrounds. JPG typically have um, some sort of darkness in the background. So you want to use a PNG for that. And then once you've chosen the, the image, probably your brand logo, you can change the location of it by picking one of the boxes and then you just click OK and then next. And then you would just pick the folder that you want to produce the video into. So once you're done there, you would just click finish and that would produce the video. Now the other option I want to show you is if you already have videos on YouTube that you've uploaded, there's actually a way to put a watermark into your videos directly from your creator studio. So if you go up to your icon, you click up top right there, you go down to creator studio. There's one option here that says branding. And it says add a watermark. So you just click that. And then when have you go through the same process, you just pick a folder where your file is. And you can see here they also recommend a PNG or a GIF file and then you would just choose a file and click save and then you're all set and so these are just two really easy ways of adding a watermark to all of your videos to not only help prevent piracy but also to add a nice little branding element to all of your visual media so that people become more familiar with your brand